Yeah, 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 yeah. What's the deal? What's the deal? It's your boy who is in though. And we back talking sports. So today I got a um it's gonna be a good one right here. Good video. Well, as you know, Kobe Bryant is my favorite player of all time. Really, one of my top three favorite athletes of all time. You also know, from Detroit, I've been a lifelong Pistons fan. Started rooting for the Warriors around 20, uh, 2008 when the We Believe team that's when I really started watching the Warriors. Then became an avid fan when they um, drafted Curry. So from like 2010 on. But <clears throat> while Kobe was in the league, I always wanted the Lakers to win. From the time I started watching Kobe. So I was I was an honorary Lakers fan, I guess you could say. But it was really because Kobe was on the team. But. I hated to see the Lakers lose. So that's why in 2004, it really was bittersweet because I didn't want to see the Lakers lose and, and Kobe lose, but I was not going against my, you know what I'm saying? I was not going against my home squad. But I'm going to give y'all the reason, the two reasons why I stopped rooting for the Lakers. Jeannie Buss. And Kobe retirement. I mean, Kobe uh, Achilles. Sorry, not retirement, Achilles. Jeannie Buss and Kobe tearing his Achilles. When Jeannie Buss took over the Lakers, she destroyed the franchise. Her and Jim Buss, just terrible. But she has been terrible. And that leads me into what this video is about to tell you about them retiring in LeBron's jersey as a Laker, man. Did. Um, and the hierarchy that some of us feel like, out of respect to some of the to uh, putting LeBron in a hierarchy that some of us feel like, out of respect to some of the Lakers of the past, he may not have done enough to earn that quite yet. You know what I mean? But she confirms, and I'll put a link to this article in the pinned comment in the comment section below, she confirms that she does indeed plan on retiring LeBron James's jersey number and hanging it in the rafters of Crypto Arena. So she said... Um, in an interview with Mark Medina for Sports Skeeter, the standard for having your jersey retired as a Laker is when a player is inducted into the Hall of Fame. I have absolutely no doubt that LeBron will make it to the Basketball Hall of Fame. What? No, it is not. See, this is what I'm talking about, bro. This is ridiculous, bro. LeBron has not done enough for his jersey to be retired as a Laker, bro. That is disrespectful, bro. That's disrespectful to Magic. Disrespectful to Shaq. Disrespectful to Kobe. Disrespectful to people like George Mikan. Disrespectful to D Fish. Disrespectful, bro. Come on, bro. This is what I'm talking about. The suck up. Bro, they suck up to this dude so much, bro. When he does so, then we will retire his jersey. Knowing that he will make it into the Basketball Hall of Fame, he will have his jersey number retired, no doubt about it. Um, what jersey gets retired is, is the question. LeBron has worn number six since coming to the Lakers, but this season was switched to number 23 out of respect for legendary Bill Russell. Look, I, I'm just going to say this, you know, because like I said, I'm, I'm not saying this to dump on LeBron, but 
if you're going by the standard, well, if you play for the Lakers and you're in the Hall of Fame, then your jersey's going to be retired, right? Well, then that means that people like uh, Bob McAdoo should be retired, right? Um, Jamal Woods' number should be retired with the Lakers. I'm not, I don't think his is. You know, it's, it's quite a few players who are in the Hall of Fame but only played a couple of years with the Lakers and their jerseys are not retired. Now, I get if you look at the strength that he led the team to a championship. Okay, fine. You know, all, all, all in all, I don't think I'm going to have a problem with LeBron's jersey being retired in the Raptors. I mean, he, he's coming into his sixth season as a Laker. Uh, he's, he has the high. I do. And a lot of Laker fans do. So, too raw, you on your own with that one. Because he has not done enough for his jersey to get retired. I'm sorry, bro. One title in six years is not enough for you. It's not enough, bro. Just because you passed Kareem, that don't, bro. This is what I'm talking about. They are diluting the Lakers franchise. The Lakers has always been about what? Championships. Championships. From the Showtime Lakers to the Kobe and Shaq Lakers, you feel me? To before the Showtime Lakers when Wilt and, and them was when they were going to the uh, finals every year. They was losing, but they was going to the finals. That's why Jerry West got a what one and nine uh, record. Then the George Mike and the Minneapolis Lakers, which they don't like to uh, take credit for, but won five six titles. The Lakers has always been about rings, bro. This man has not did enough, bro. And man, this gonna turn off a lot. Watch, this gonna turn off a lot of Lakers fans when they return his jersey. If he don't win another title, if he don't win at least another title. And he get his jersey retired. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Highest scoring average in Lakers history. I don't really have a problem with his jersey being retired. What, what, what I have a problem with is when people start saying things like he's a top three Laker. Um, he needs to have his, uh, a, a, a statue in his honor. Now, I think those are gestures that should only be done for people who are absolute creme de la creme legends of a franchise. You know what I mean? I, yes, he did win a championship. He did. Nigga, if they even think about giving him a statue, nigga, they better already have built Kobe's or already have built Magic's. Them the only two niggas that I think should get a should get a uh a statue. In my opinion, to get a statue, you gotta be top top to me. They could give Shaq a, a statue. But I think Kobe Magic statue should be right across from each other. LeBron don't get no damn statue, bro. What is man, bro? But he's also had a lot of disappointing seasons with the Lakers. So that's just my thing, you know what I'm saying? And then I'm also I'm like this. If we're going by this standard, did Dennis Rodman's jersey should be retired by the Chicago Bulls? I mean, it ain't like anybody else gonna wear number 91 any goddamn way. But Three years, right? Three years with the Lake, with the uh, Chicago Bulls. Three NBA championships, three rebounding titles. Um, let's look at something, right? Let's look at something. Look at Dennis Rodman's resume, right? I'm not getting into all Dennis Rodman and all that. I just wanted to talk about Jeannie Bus being a, Jeannie Bus and Kobe Achilles being a reason. I'm not a Laker that I don't root for the Lakers no more. And this notion that LeBron James should have his jersey retired, bro, after one championship in six years, bro. 
and how they're diluting the Lakers, how they moving the goalposts and diluting the Lakers franchise just for LeBron James. That is that is that is that is crazy. You feel me? Like it's really crazy. And I'm not and it's just it's just really crazy, bro. And I'm not hating on him. I just if we going by the Lakers standard, he has not done enough, bro. Will I don't even think have his jersey retired. He might have his jersey retired. But Will, you know what I'm saying? He only he ain't I don't feel he did enough for real, for real. I mean they went to they went to the finals, you know what I'm saying, and everything most of the time, you know what I'm saying, five or six times in a row and everything. But I'm talking about winning titles, bro. The Lakers have always been about rings. That's why they have 17 of them. But hey, it is what it is, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think, man. This has been Who is Hendo with another video. I'm out, man. Peace.